Hi everyone, I'm Ian Harvey, massage therapist. This is Sam. Hi. And today I'm going to show you a quick and easy stretch slash myofascial massage technique that's great for opening up this neck and chest region. In another video this week, I talk about how I don't do aggressive work or stretching with the uh, neck these days. That's no longer a massage practice that I really do. So I thought I'd show a way that I work with the neck that still takes it through its range of motion and still works with that lateral musculature, it works with the fascia, but that doesn't compromise any of the neurovasculature and that's comfortable for me and for my client. And right now I'm just applying some jojoba oil. I'm just warming things up bilaterally before I show you this unilateral move. Get yourself some real estate in the upper chest. I don't undrape a whole lot, but I want to be able to get under this clavicle here, inferior to this clavicle. Your far hand, so in this case I'm working on the right side, so my right arm is going to be forming a loose fist with thumbs up. And I'm, I'm going to be resting my elbow on the table. And my other hand is going to be creating a flat plane. I'm going to raise my elbow up high so that the weight of my arm is doing part of this work. And I'm going to spread in either direction. My fist travels up the lateral neck. My open hand travels outward from the sternum, out laterally, ending up on the humerus. Now, why do I spread away like that? It's because, while working with the upper chest, I've noticed that the head seems to follow. As I drag out laterally, the head will go in that direction. So, I want to spread that fascia in either direction. I feel like this upper chest fascia has a lot to do with the position of the neck. If the chest is tied on both sides, I'm thinking that this is going to pull forward on this fascia up along the lateral neck. So in that spirit, I would like to spread those away from each other. And as you notice, this causes the head to turn. This is a great way of working with the natural range of motion of that client's neck without forcing anything. It gets the head over to one side without you having to just grab the head and turn it. And now I've got all sorts of access to this one side. So I can do this great unilateral petrissage. I can do specific work along the clavicles, up along the levator scapula. And I can come under here and work on the posterior thoracic region. And to bring the head back, I just do that head turner technique that I've showcased in another video. If you'd like to see that, you can click in the corner or down in the description. All right, let me know what you think of this myofascial spreading technique. It's quick and easy, but uh, I've gotten more compliments on it than I have on any other technique ever. So that's it, have a good day, bye.